Hello again, it's Priscilla Batzell in Springfield, Florida at Expressionist Art Studio Gallery with a cake tool, an 8x10 canvas, and some blooming paint mixtures all ready to go. And I may or may not swipe this with something other than that, but this is how I'm going to start. And I'm going to give myself... Actually, I'm going to pour that right out of a bit larger container so I don't have to fill up that container quite so soon. That is just straight onyx black from Walmart. It's not the blackest black. You could probably find something a lot better if you looked. But it's what I've got, so it's what I'm using. And since most of it gets poured away, and in this case I poured away into a, uh, a restaurant container, this is the OXO omelet turning spatula, and I would prefer to have most of my surrounding areas covered beforehand, even to the point where I kind of wish I had done the edges, but that's basically because of the video. Um, the paint pouring itself takes quite a while because the paint is so heavy, but that also means that coverage is going to be a lot better, especially with the black, which is, when it's with pouring medium, not as, not as good coverage. I'm just going to try and get all of my edges, and then I'm going to wipe off, actually I'm going to put my spatula right into the bucket and um, I'm going to try this first but there's no guarantee where I'm going to go from there. I've got this resting in a stainless steel chafing dish and I may pour some paint off in there, we'll see. I have chosen my colors Sorry, I'm quiet. I don't know what I'm doing, so every, every new experience is just that, a new experience. I have some darker, some darker pink that I kind of want to use. I kind of promised myself I was going to attempt to go a little bit lighter on the colors, but if you know me, you know that might be an issue. <laughs> I've got, um, I want all of that off of there, but not dripping down the outside of my container. Um, I've got cell activator, and I've got cell activator in pink. And I am going to blow down into this. And actually, I said I was going to swipe, didn't I? <laughs> okay. Um, I'm going to blow down to it anyway. Just so I can see if anything's happening. And then I'm probably going to put some black cell activator on there as well. Because I want to. Because I can. I may not I may not swipe. <laughs> I probably will, but I can't I may I may not. I have been known to change my mind. I love the colors. Some are primary elements, some are um, master modern masters, some are well, not in this case. I do use a folk art color shift. And it works very well. I really think if I use the uh, the cake tool, that I might lose what's what's really great about this right now. So, um, maybe next time. I want a little more cell activator right here. That white is just white mica powder, and the gold is gold mica powder. And the orange is orange mica powder. The 
magenta that I'm using as a cell activator and in the color is uh, a golden product of golden fluid. I'm trying to let this stuff set up a little bit. I have some beautiful cells here. I could stop right now and be pretty happy. I dislike pouring this away very much. But that has caused me to experiment. It's cold out here today, so whatever would be moving a little faster is going to be moving a lot slower. Although it seems to be moving pretty well right there, surprisingly. One day I'd like to be able to keep some negative space. <laughs> it's not looking a lot like this day. Part of my brain goes like, well, if we could find a way to cover the edges, <laughs> we could keep all that. So I've got one edge covered over here and I'm tempted to have a look at that and see what else I might want in there. I really want to swipe. I'm going to put some swipe color, i.e. am I? Oh, it's really popping nicely. Maybe I don't want to do that. <laughs> oh, it's so hard. I am not inclined. I'm going to try and save this and this. I'm not sure how that's going to go for me. I think if I really want to save this, I'm going to have to add some more pillow paint. And then use it to lead that right down there. Right to the edge. Beautiful colors. Not as many cells as I'm sure plenty of people have. I am most, mostly recentering my paint because I want to come down on this other side. I just hate giving up that negative space. I really, really do. But I am managing to save quite a bit of my patterning by going slow and being cautious. And I can go back in the other direction and probably stretch these out, which I love. And I keep thinking I can probably pick some of them up. I may have to swipe yet. I don't mind adding my beautiful colors to my uh, compilation in there. And everything is still moving. I'm fully capable of scooping those out of there. Oh, I'm getting some beautiful cells. Some, some good things are happening. Yes! <laughs> I like it! And I'm going to take this paint over here and put it down right on this side. Because I can! I know I can. I got away with it earlier today. I'm going to do it again. And I am covered. Oh, that's great. I'm covered with paint too, again. But that's just gorgeous. I'm I feel successful. <laughs> and I didn't uh, I didn't add a lot of anything. I got paint on me <laughs> all over me. I'm so not used to that. But uh, this is absolutely fantastic. I'm really really pleased. And and maybe a little surprised. I take my paint and I'll bring my container back over here. I have beautiful cells. They're mostly here. There's some subtle ones here. There's some down there. Um, I could probably keep going, but I'm not going to. And I have been so far 
torching. I'm going to take the paint off my hands, put it in the bucket. I'm going to rinse off. You guys can look at that for a moment. I'm super stoked about this. The colors are just beautiful. And uh, I wonder, before I torch, if I could blow a few places out. Not that it really needs it, because it really doesn't. And maybe torching is not a great idea, but I, I love popping some cells, so... I just, I really love the, the black background. Oh, I'm so stoked! <laughs> that white mica powder worked like a charm. I'm really surprised and very pleased, and I'll show you guys the angles that I can see it at. 1001, 1002, 1003. Takes at least three seconds to focus, as I recall. There you go. That's the view that I really appreciated. So this is Priscilla Batsell in Spring Hill, Florida at Expressionist Art Studio Gallery. Enjoy uh, inviting you to see tomorrow's video on Expressionist Art Studio Gallery Appreciation Group on Facebook for students or on my channel, uh, Expressionist Art Studio Gallery, Priscilla Batsell, YouTube, on the community board where you can also, also find uh, creative playlists of over a thousand videos organized in, by the hundred and by genre. You can, if you wouldn't mind, I would love to have your thumbs up. That would be fantastic. If you want to help me out, there's a few ways to do that. One is to watch the video longer, because the only thing the YouTube algorithm knows that will keep me here is if you watch longer. Uh, your thumbs up is really nice to have. Your comments are awesome to have. They keep my morale up. Well, well um, revenue has gone down, 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 down at YouTube. And... Um, I love you guys. There's 85,000 of you. I do sell my artwork. Selling paintings does does keep the studio in paint. Uh, monthly monthly drawing for one of eight paintings or one of either one of my two books, Volume 1 or Volume 2. Both you can see on the Amazon link under Show More if you shop there. At no idea cost you. It helps me out. Um, the end screens on this video and every other video will have the monthly exhibition video and that will share with you what the prizes are if you watch that video both at the beginning and the end. Underneath the video you will find Teespring, my clothing, um, all over print t-shirts, all over print leggings, and lots of other cool stuff. And um, the paint pouring recipe will be down there as well. Um, I know I'm forgetting something. Facebook Expressionist Art Studio Gallery Appreciation Group um, isn't the only Facebook group. The other one is Totes and More. And you can find a Shop Now button and go see what I've been posting since 2013 on Pixels.com and Fine Art America. Or um, Fans and collectors, starting with Expressionist Art Studio Gallery. I love you guys. I can't remember everything else. I'm just, I'm completely enamored, and um, there's even a dragon for me down here, upside down for you. He's a cartoon dragon, though. So I love you guys. I'll see you soon. Um, check for tomorrow's video if you want, and uh, look for the PayPal and, pay, pay, <coughs> PayPal and Patreon icons on the channel header, bottom right-hand corner, or the links under the video if you want to get into the drawing. I love you guys. Third time. Third time's a charm. Bye for now. Priscilla out. Fabulous. I'm so happy. I'm finally getting the hang of this. Bye guys. See you in on.